Hey, Steve. Yeah, Steven, I can't see you. No, I can't I can't hear you either. No, I can't hear you. Hey, Steven here with Dream On Studios and I'm here for a much needed Zoom tutorial. Basically how to make your Zoom easier to see, hear, and overall just un understand, I guess. There's a few things to a Zoom call. There's the video, the audio, and the practice. I say practice, really that's like a miscellaneous category, but we'll get to that later. Now, I know not everyone has a super cool camera, but most people do have a webcam, which can work, but to be honest, your problem isn't necessarily the camera, it's probably your lights, or lack thereof. If you have some sort of desk lamp or external ring light, this can drastically improve your image. But nothing's better at lighting than the sun. Open a window and sit close by, and if you have an extra light, use that as like a fill. We aren't trying to make a movie here, so as long as they can clearly see you, you're already doing great. All right, I got my video figured out, but it sounds terrible. Why is it echoing? Well, oddly enough, you and whoever you're calling, you just need headphones. Your voice playing back through their speakers is picked up by their mic and is creating that echo. Headphones should eliminate that entirely. All right, let's talk about practice. First, angles. If you're on a computer with a webcam, it won't be super simple to switch this up, but if you're using a phone or an external webcam, I would suggest messing with your angles. You'll want a straight on or slightly downward angle of your face for the best looking you there is. It might seem like a super simple idea, but it really will help. Secondly, and this tip's a little strange, try to make eye contact with the lens. It'll feel weird at first because you won't be looking at the person, but you will be looking at the person. Thanks for watching. I hope this improved your setup and made you look more like a pro.